In this video, we will show you how to adjust the length of your Garmin metal watch band to fit your wrist. The special tools needed to adjust a metal watch band can be bought at relevant stores or online stores. Besides doing it yourself, you can also go to an authorized Garmin service center or a general watch shop for professional service. First, put on your watch and estimate the length to be adjusted. It looks like there are about four watch links to be removed. Next, detach the watch band. It is recommended to disassemble it evenly. So, we will remove two watch links on each side. Garmin has four types of metal watch bands, each with a different length adjustment way. This is the first type. On the watch link, you can see a groove in the pinhole. There are arrows on the second type of watch band. The pinhole is identical when viewed from both sides, and the metal pin inside it has smooth surfaces without grooves. There are also arrows on the third type of watch band. But the two sides of the pinhole are different. One side of the metal pin is thicker than the other side and has a slit in the center. The inner side of the fourth type of watch band is made of rubber. We will show you how to adjust them one by one. Please skip to the chapter of your watch band. To adjust the first type of watch band, you will need a small flathead screwdriver with a diameter of about 1.4 mm and a pin punch with a diameter of about 0.9 mm. Align the screwdriver with the watch link pin and unscrew it by rotating counterclockwise. Then, remove the watch link pin. Detach the watch link. Repeat the above steps to remove the watch links one by one. Next, let's assemble the watch links back. Align the pinholes. Insert the watch link pin. And tighten it with the screwdriver. Repeat the above steps to assemble the other side of the watch band. If you want to fine tune the length of your watch band, you can adjust it from here to make an adjustment shorter than one watch link. First, fully unfold the watch band. Next, using the pin punch, press down the spring bar on one side. Detach the watch band. Block both sides with your fingers to prevent the spring bar from popping out. Next, let's install the spring bar into another hole to make the watch band shorter slightly. First, install the spring bar into the tube. Insert one end of the spring bar into the hole. Then press the other end with the flathead screwdriver and push it into the hole. And it is done. Put on your watch and try its tightness. If you still want to adjust, repeat the above steps. Please keep the removed watch links. To adjust the second type of watch band, you will need a watch link remover. There are two common types. And a pin punch with a diameter of about 0.9 mm, a small flathead screwdriver, and a pair of needle nose pliers. The arrows on the watch band shows the direction to remove the watch link pin. Place the watch band on the watch link remover and align the pin puncher with the pinhole of the watch link. Confirm again that the arrows point to the removing direction. Rotate the handle to move the pin puncher, and it will push the pin out of the pinhole. After pushing it to the end, move the pin puncher back and remove the watch band. Use the pliers to remove the watch link pin. Detach the watch link. Besides the watch link pin, there is a pin tube inside the pinhole, please be careful not to lose it. Repeat the above steps to remove the watch links one by one. Next, we will show you the other type of watch link remover. First, place the watch band into the holding block. The arrows should point downward, and the pinhole to be disassembled should be aligned with a hole on the holding block. Next, align the pin puncher with the pin inside the pinhole, and hammer it to push the pin out of the pinhole. After hammering it to the end, remove the watch band. Use the pliers to remove the watch link pin. Detach the watch link. Besides the watch link pin, there is a pin tube inside the pinhole, please be careful not to lose it. Repeat the above steps to remove the watch links one by one. Next, let's assemble the watch links back. First, install the pin tube into the watch link. Please be aware of the orientation. The side with a groove should point to the end of the arrow. Align the pinholes of the watch links and insert the pin from the opposite direction of the arrow. Then, 
press the pin against your desk to push it into the pinhole. Finally, use the watch link remover to slightly push the pin into the pinhole. Repeat the above steps to assemble the watch band on the other side. And it is done. Please keep the removed watch links. If you want to fine-tune the length of your watch band, you can adjust it from here to make an adjustment shorter than one watch link. Go to 206 for the tutorial. To adjust the third type of watch band, you will need a watch link remover. There are two common types. The arrows on the watch band shows the direction to remove the watch link pin. Place the watch band on the watch link remover and align the pin puncher with the pinhole of the watch link. Confirm again that the arrows point to the removing direction. Rotate the handle to move the pin puncher, and it will push the pin out of the pinhole. After pushing it to the end, move the pin puncher back and remove the watch band. Remove the watch link pin. Detach the watch link. Repeat the above steps to remove the watch links one by one. Next, we will show you the other type of watch link remover. First, place the watch band into the holding block. The arrows should point downward, and the pinhole to be disassembled should be aligned with a hole on the holding block. Next, align the pin puncher with the pin inside the pinhole, and hammer it to push the pin out of the pinhole. After hammering it to the end, remove the watch band. Remove the watch link pin. Detach the watch link. Repeat the above steps to remove the watch links one by one. Next, let's assemble the watch links back. Align the pinholes of the watch links and insert the pin from the opposite direction of the arrow. Please be aware of the orientation. The split side should point to the top of the arrow. Then, press the pin against your desk to push it into the pinhole. Finally, use the watch link remover to slightly push the pin into the pinhole. Repeat the above steps to assemble the watch band on the other side. And it is done. Please keep the removed watch links. To adjust the fourth type of watch band, you will need a spring bar remover. The width of its V-end is about 1.2 millimeters. Insert the spring bar remover into the top of the spring bar between two watch links. Press it down to detach the watch link. Repeat the above steps to remove the watch links one by one. Next, let's assemble the watch links back. First, insert one end of the spring bar into the hole. Then. Press and hold the other end with the spring bar remover and push it into the hole. Slightly move the watch band to make sure that the spring bar is in the hole. Repeat the above steps to assemble the watch band on the other side. And it is done. Please keep the removed watch links. And that's it. Thanks for watching.